intervention, there were statistically significant gains that were made in the reading achievement of Tongan students. Scott Francis Ray in Education, University Doctoral Scholar. Scott's thesis argues that Dickens, through Hard Times, is a credible source of information for philosophical and historical discussions around education, with special attention being given to the role of education as it is controlled and utilized by the interests of industrial capitalism. Andrew Roberts in bioengineering. Paul refined an MRI compatible ergometer and imaging methods to assess cardiovascular function during exercise. These methods were applied to a clinical study evaluating the effects of two treatments in patients with aortic disease, which indicated one treatment may preferentially delay the need for surgical intervention. Timothy John Roper in Electrical and Electronic Engineering. Timothy's research made significant contributions to the difficult practical problem of acquiring accurate calibrated hyperspectral images for use in industrial applications. Hyperspectral image processing promises a substantial improvement in machine vision capability, and this work advanced the problem of reliable human skin detection to improve occupational safety in dangerous industrial environments. Jennifer Hajung Tatabi in Education, University Doctoral Scholar. Jennifer's thesis tackles the discomforting yet timely social justice concerns of disadvantage and poverty, which have a direct impact on an estimated 25% of New Zealand children. Her investigation of how New Zealand graduate diploma in teaching secondary pre-service teachers engage with the issues of disadvantage and poverty has immediate implications for the ways in which teachers are prepared to teach an increasingly diverse New Zealand student population. <laughs> Yu Cheng Tu in Electrical and Electronic Engineering. Yu Cheng explored transparency a term used in government and business that implied information openness but without a precise definition. She developed an engineering definition of transparency and demonstrated its use in software engineering, particularly for improving communication during the software development process. Shanghai Wei in Chemical and Materials Engineering. Shanghai investigated the effects of alloy and composition and processing technology on the microstructure and mechanical properties of advanced magnesium alloys. His research made significant contributions to the development of a new type of ductile magnesium alloy, which has great potential for applications such as car parts and electronic devices. And in absentia, all those other persons named in the official record who have qualified for the conferment of a degree or the award of a diploma in the Faculty of Education, the Faculty of Engineering, and the Faculty of Law. We are near the end of this graduation ceremony. On behalf of the university, I invite all today's graduates to stand and receive the congratulations of us all. Please stand.
And while you are standing, it would be a good time for the graduates to show their appreciation of their families and supporters and the staff of the university who have helped them as they achieved their qualifications. Can you please remain standing? This concludes this meeting of council and convocation of the university for the conferment of degrees and the award of diplomas. I now invite you to sing the first verse of God Defend New Zealand in Māori, then in English. The words are printed on the reverse of your programme. Thank you.